Um, can relate to this story. Um, you know, people people hear like, oh my god, you're in Wicked. Wow, wow, are you one of the witches? And I'm like, yeah, kind of, yeah, technically, yeah. And they're like, stop it. Are you Alphaba? And I'm like, oh, I, no, I'm Nessa, I'm Nessa. Blank stare. Like, full blank stare. They're like, and I'm like, oh, like, like, I'm the Wicked Witch of the East that turns Bach into a Tin Man. Blake stare. And then, uh, yeah, right? Totally. And I'm like, Ruby Shoes, da, 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 da. And they're like, oh, yeah. And they look for the exit. So, uh, anyway, to anyone uh, who is the second fiddle, who's been second fiddle, this one's for you. Thank you. Thank you. Stephen wrote a Broadway show, technically second-hand, a novel that we all now know created super fans. In the book, just like the show, Nessa was outshone. A second fiddle sister breeds a love-strick inside It's no wonder that I feel abused. I never have a thing that ain't been used. Hold on. <laughs> yeah. Not Elphaba. I'm wearing secondhand hats. bus yesterday, I realized that the actual lyrics of Secondhand Rose are kind of quite pro-environment, right? They're like all about like renewables and recycling and like regeneration of, of, of old items. So I thought, you know, this song could be like a climate crisis anthem, no? Like, so, so I want to invoke the mindful advocacy of Elphaba right now, and I want us to take the lyrics, I put some of them on the on the table for you, the original lyrics of Secondhand Rose, and I want to celebrate recycling, repurposing, and love. So please, sing along with me, comrades. Here we go. Don't! <laughs>